do positive affirmations work? A lot of people are cynical about positive affirmations, but I can tell you from my own experience that positive affirmations not only work, they can transform your life completely. So in today's episode, I'm going to show you an example of the types of things you can say to yourself. So let's go ahead and look at those positive affirmations. I'm aligned with the energy of prosperity and abundance. I am the author of my story that is filled with love, success, and joy. My life is a reflection of my inner state and inner thoughts. I am the creator of my reality and I can manifest anything I really want into my life. Everything I desire is already here. I am worthy of all the good that comes to me. I effortlessly attract abundance into my life. I am in perfect harmony with the universe. My thoughts shape my destiny and I choose positivity. I am open to receiving miracles in my life. I live in a state of constant gratitude and joy. I am the embodiment of health and vitality. I attract love and respect from people who I meet. I have limitless potential and creativity. I am surrounded by positive, loving energy. I trust the process of life and let go of all resistance. I am deserving of infinite happiness and fulfillment. My life is a reflection of my inner thoughts and I choose to think positively. I attract the right people and circumstances every time. I live in a state of constant flow and synchronicity. I am in control of my thoughts. I guide my thoughts positively. Every day I'm moving closer to my goals. I am grateful for the abundance that I have and the abundance that's on its way. As I said, better to go into them and get into the mood and the vibration. But for myself, I practice affirmations all the time, ongoing, when I'm driving, when I'm waiting in line at the bank, when I'm swimming, when I'm with clients, I just keep repeating inwardly. It's like an ongoing prayer. In Greek, we have the word askitis. And what does the word uh, ascetic mean? It means someone who is practicing. You are a practitioner. So you keep practicing positive affirmations all day long, um, hailing the glory of your life in so many ways that eventually it's going to become part of you, right? And it's going to become your, not second nature, your first nature. It took me a while to realize this because I kept having that resistance, the cynicism that said, well, it's not true right now. So how am I going to repeat it? Especially before you go to bed at night and when you wake up early in the morning, that's the best time if you don't want to be practicing all day. Although I myself have made it a habit to be more or less practicing inwardly all day. Uh, basically um, hailing the beauty of my life, the gratitude for my life. The trick with positive affirmations is to just keep repeating them and make it a habit on a daily basis, I would say on an ongoing basis, to keep repeating them whether or not you're in that state at the moment, whether or not you're in a positive state, just simply saying the words. Now, obviously, it's even better if you're feeling the words. Be my guest and add even more and more specific things that make you feel good. Prepare yourself for a beautiful journey, dear friend. 
And now for part two of this meditation, where we will be going deeper to really reprogram your subconscious mind for optimum result. This longer extended version is only available to members of my YouTube channel. And I look forward to reading your comments. Please like and share with your friends on social media.